you guys, welcome back to some more Legend of Zelda Lost Isle, and I am leaving the castle. Uh, in the last video, I got captured, ow, I got captured by a grasp, and I lost my, uh, my shield. It was incredibly sad and depressing and lonely and full of death and despair and ruin and pretty much the worst feeling in the world. Uh, but it's not all that dark and gloomy, because I can just go two screens to the left here, where I will find a cave which uh, I was actually at, I actually entered this cave way before, oh, back in the day, you know, before I entered this never-ending castle that I've been in for the last seemingly forever. Uh, but there's a treasure chest that appears once I kill all these enemies, and inside the treasure chest is a, another one of these shields. So I got my, uh, I got my shield back. So, um, yeah. Uh, there was a bunch of these caves throughout the overworld, these shield caves, as I will call them. Um, fortunately, I didn't actually lose my shield on screen at all. Uh, a few times I lost it, I lost it off screen, but I just went back and, uh, you know, just edited that out. But I was pretty far along and I didn't want to re-record, so I figured, hey, there's a shield, just two screens left, so it's not that bad. Anyway, where we left off in the video. Uh, we created a shortcut so I can easily get to basically the fourth floor of the dungeon. Um, and a few things I want to point out that I completely messed up in my last video. There was that block pushing puzzle. And uh, for those of you who, if you didn't watch the last video, you'll have no idea what I'm talking about. But uh, there was that block pushing puzzle and there was a, I was confused and I thought the developer sort of like broke the game. Turns out that uh, I could have just pushed that top block left. I, for some reason, I thought you can only push it once, but I could have pushed it multiple times. So I feel kind of stupid about that. Anyway, uh, this screen. To the left, I actually went through that in the last video. That's a, that takes you to a bunch of enemies. And uh, to the right, this takes you to it's just a basic puzzle room. If I go up a screen, it takes you to a block room. Uh, however, both of those eventually just lead back to this screen. So it's like you they give you an option. And this is the same thing they did with the previous floor with that block pushing puzzle I was just talking about. They give you an option. Do you want to take action or puzzle? Both leads you here. Both times you hit that switch. Both times you'd come down here, step on this switch, and leads you to the staircase. So I think it's kind of cool that the developers actually give you options. Uh, like if you prefer puzzles, if you prefer action, you can do uh, whichever you please. So, cool little option, cool little uh, something unique about this game. So, yeah. Alright, one of these things. Alright, the two doors opened, and also that door to the bottom left closed. But, uh, let's go see what's in here first. Uh, ow. Alright. Ooh, it's a staircase. Ow. Run, run, run. All right. Ow. Okay. Nope. Oh boy. Ow. Okay, this is... Let's get the arrow out. Do I even... I don't even need to kill this guy, do I? Well, I probably should. Okay, this stair... Alright, just ditch it. There we go. Uh, this leads here, and, uh... Okay, that's a... Is that a... What is that? Is that a door? According to the map, I can go... Oh, I can go right. Oh, uh, that looks like a bombable... A series of bombable walls on the right side. Oh, arrows. That's weird. But, um... <laughs> yeah, I'm on the fifth floor. This gotta be a secret. There we go. Alright, so... Oh no, a step ladder! Okay, well I will remember to come here. Let's come back to the fifth floor. So let's go back to that room where I played the little... Ow. Oh, where I played the melody, and instead, let me head... Le left the screen. Do I have to go... Okay, good. At least I don't have to play it again. I wonder how I opened that door. Maybe I have to play the song again? Um... Alright. Oh boy. They get through these. There are a lot of fires and keys and enemies here. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Alright, yep, just spike my way through the room. <laughs> Alright, we're back outside once again. Let's see, 
treasure chest? No treasure chest. Uh, oh, okay. Leads to an alternate entrance. Can I go up here? No, I can't. Uh, let's see what's inside. Alright. Oh, there's some switches down here. Oh. Alright. You were too slow. You're not worthy enough to attain our treasure. Huh. Is this some sort of... Oh! Okay. <laughs> this must have been in the last comments, in the last video, people were commenting about the boomerang puzzle. I guess that's what this is. Uh, oh boy. I guess I have to... Do I just keep hitting that one over and over? No, no. No, you were too slow. You're not worthy enough to obtain our treasure. Okay, so I have to keep throwing my boomerang and keep hitting the statues over and over. Uh, however, since I'm using an Xbox 360 controller and I don't have a D-pad, this is actually kind of hard. Uh, but, well, I will have to deal with it. Alright. It's, it's, it's really not that bad once you get... You just gotta sort of get in a rhythm a little bit. Come on. Come on. Got it! Success! Alright. That was not that bad. Uh, I know people in the comments were saying this is like the hardest thing in the history of the universe, but... You got ladder! Yes! Finally! <laughs> Been looking for this for like the last literally like 15 episodes <laughs> ever since I was in the falls um oh wait a sec did it just automatically take me out here and even go through the last room uh anyway there is so much we can do uh first and foremost we are uh we're gonna head back right like two screens and go up to the top floor uh there was that treasure chest that I ugh I gotta play the song again uh there was a treasure chest I just saw but I needed the step ladder to get across. Uh, there was also, let's see, where else? Uh, there was a room on the like almost the far right of the dungeon. Uh, there was also a room in the basement on the left side. So uh, there was a lot of things, a lot of places to go, and uh, we will be using the ladder at all those locations, plus all the overworld locations that I will eventually get to. But, alright, good, no, no grasps. Okay. Oh, just a small key. Okay. So, we've got two small keys on hand. Um, I don't know of any locked doors right now, but... So, we are going to do quite a bit of backtracking to get all the way to... I don't know where to go to first. I guess I'll go to the basement since that's on this side. Ow. Of the, uh... That's on this side of the dungeon. Uh, okay, do I gotta play this song again? How do we get down from here? Push this over. Um. Right. Uh, okay. Let me... When I left and came back to that room, it was closed, so I got an idea. Let me just leave the dungeon, come back in, and maybe that'll reset it. That seems to be the solution. Come on, go through the door. Aha! See, Moss, for a guy with no brains, you sure are a genius. Alright, come on, Dark Knight, don't walk into the hole. There we go. Alright. So, uh, I think we can actually just keep going down the stairs over and over and over and over to get all the way down to the basement. So, this is not that much backtracking at all. Uh, yeah, I think uh, one, one screen right here was this the basement. Yeah. Uh, or no, this was not the basement. I had to go. Oh, it was the left side of this uh, area. Okay, so I gotta go left. 
two screens to get there? Uh, yeah, I think so. But, okay, we are making quite a bit of progress. Pretty happy with this. Maybe I'll actually get to the dungeon boss. Heck, maybe I'll even beat the dungeon boss in this video. I, I don't know. This, this is like the never-ending dungeon, but it seems like it's coming to an end. And it's quite exciting that uh, we read that pillar a long time ago. No grasp. This is like the only... These blue Gibdos seem like kind of out of place, considering there's like none of them in the whole dungeon. The whole overworld, other than the flows, and then they're just here. But, okay, so I think the right side led to. Okay, let's go down first. I think the stepladder portion was uh, down a screen. Uh, yeah, okay, this is where I I left off. Uh, let's see, where does this lead? Okay, and right, before doing that, let's go to the right and see what we have here. Anything? Oh, a switch. Right, that just lowers. Okay. A lot of places to go. Let's go down first, I guess. And... Okay. Well, there's one of those small keys. Oh, you can't freeze Gibdos. I guess the boomerang... They're one of the enemies where the boomerang does damage, though. Alright. Block and run. Alright, come on. I hate these fireballs. They, they, whenever they're in rooms where there's a lot of enemies, they can be quite devastating. Oh, is this leading back to that same room I was just at? Just, I'm just going in a circle here? No! No! I got... Wow. Alright, I'm back. Hopefully I don't get <laughs> grabbed by a, uh, another one of those... <laughs> wall I can't believe I got grabbed by a wall master. I think that was the first time all game I've been grabbed by a wall master. Oh, look, they're not even any wall masters. They didn't respond. But, uh, okay, so we're gonna head up. Yeah, did I just walk in a big circle? Just... Did I just. Hold on. Let me see something for a second. Oh, okay, that was a cage. Alright, so I had to do that. So I actually needed to use two. Alright, I'm out of small keys. It's kind of disheartening. But, hopefully, I don't need to use an. Uh, hopefully, I don't use an... need to use another one. Alright, this is that. Okay, so I'm back to... I was right over there just a minute ago, so I guess that's just a shortcut block thing. But, ooh. Step ladder puzzle. Alright, let me kill these wall masters as they appear. Okay. The thing about the step ladders, you can only walk in one direction. So, uh, like I can't just create the step ladder like that and then go up. I have to walk. What? Okay. This is a. Is this like a puzzle? Like, so I gotta. Okay, I gotta get here. And got it. Okay. Well, first of all, let me go down. See what if there's anything here. Is that a barrier? No, it's not. Okay. Clearly, I have to get to the right side of the room. Okay. That's not that bad. Alright, so wow, this is. There's step ladder puzzles. This is uh, kind of unique. Kind of cool, actually. Alright, good. At least this is not very sensitive, so you can. There's room for lenience. And it's only water, but I'm like treating it like it's a pit almost, and worried I'm gonna fall. Okay, I can go. Uh, I could go. Well, let's go down first. I could go right as well. Oh, this leads. Oh wow! I was here, and eh, I'm just gonna leave that hundred. I can't even get it. If I really am desperate for arrows later on, I will come back here. But yeah. Uh, all right, we are. Ooh, one more die. Looks like this is just a torch lighting puzzle. Shouldn't be anything too difficult. Come on. Go. Yes. All right, what do we got in here? Uh, more endless enemies. I think the next step is we got to get the uh, the the nightmare key. That's our night. Did I just load the nightmare key? Was this Link's Awakening? Uh, the boss key, whatever it's called in this game. Uh, because we actually know where the the boss dungeon, the boss room is actually just 
almost right next to the start screen of the dungeon. It's like, it's in that secret room which is like two screens over to the right. So, um, yeah. But I think, uh, we need to get the, uh, we gotta get to that key, basically. And, alright, let's see. This stupid Zora is kind of annoying here. Okay, let's see. I can't get to that. Die. There we go. Alright, good. I don't think I want to fall. It's a strange looking hole right there, but let's just head up. Uh, okay. Make my way around. At least these aren't. It would be a lot more annoying if there were like dark nuts in here. Uh, okay, before I go that way, let's see if I can. I could go up a screen, so. There's got to be some sort of secret. Jeez, I'm running low on health. Only have four hearts. Ah, there we go. Oh, I don't have a key. I oh no, I'm short a key. No. Okay, so I'm gonna have to backtrack and get a key. Um, I assume now ugh, there's that area on the far right of the dungeon. Maybe that has a key. But if so, I will be back. Maybe I'll just get a key right here. This is one screen to the left, is that... Uh... Oh, I was here a long time ago, actually. I remember this room. Well, maybe there's a small... Ooh, this is a... Gliok! Oh, wait, did that just happen? There was an empty treasure chest in there. But, alright, looks like we're gonna fight Gliok again. I don't have much health this time. Uh, Gliok is not the dungeon boss, though. He's just a... No. He's just a... mini-boss, I guess. This is gonna have more heads than before? I don't remember. I do have the upgraded sword compared to last time. And this room is not as narrow as the first time I fought Gliok. So this is not that bad. Oh, boy. Oh, oh, boy. Come on, Moss. Don't get dead. Don't get dead. Don't get dead. Alright, good. How about a small key? Ooh! A piece of heart! That's... unique? <laughs> alright. Well... Alright. Well, we know we have to... Once we get a key, we'll have to come back here. And I think a few screens left... Where am I exactly? This is... Oh, yeah, this area. So, alright, I'm gonna backtrack to the left part, or the right part of the dungeon. There was that, it's really just one screen I can think of that had, um, that had a, oh wait, I can actually leave the dungeon as well in that screen to the right. There was that cave. So I'm gonna head over there. In, in any case, I'm gonna go to the right side of the dungeon. Um, Judging by the fact that I'm near the... coming up close to the 20 minute mark of this video, I, I don't think I'm going to beat the dungeon this time, but it looks like I'm pretty close to the end of the, the dungeon. Uh, so, we will probably beat the dungeon. Uh, we have one more video, I think. I'm, I'm fairly confident in that assessment at this point. Uh, Alright, let's go, let's go down the steps first. Uh, let's go to that step ladder. Probably that's where there is that. Oh, jeez. Come on. Uh, probably that's where the small key is, I imagine. But I want to know what's in the cave. Maybe there's another heart piece or something. Because that's outside the dungeon, so I can't imagine that is a small key. Alright, was it here one screen? Oh, no, not here. It was one screen up and then to the right. Yeah, one screen up was with all the grasps. I have this dungeon memorized, it's kind of sad, but... <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, you know, we're gonna kill these guys. Run. There we go. Uh, alright, this was this... yeah, right here. No, oh, no. Alright, so I got the small key I was looking for. Um, so apparently there's probably another small key somewhere in the dungeon, because... I got that extra small key that 
Um, well, apparently it was just that extra. So I can just strategically well, I'll just use the staircase. Uh, so there's probably a small key somewhere else hidden that uh, I am missing. But I guess the world will never know. But I'm going to make my way to that cave outside the dungeon. And that'll probably be the last thing I do in this video. So uh, we will go and take care of that. And uh, yeah. I don't know how long that's going to lead to something. Uh, I don't know if that'll lead to... I, I'm guessing it's going to lead to a heart piece or maybe a magic shield upgrade or something of that nature. Um, magic meter upgrade, sorry. Um, although, wait. Isn't this where I was? Oh, there we go. I don't know why that was sort of cryptic and hidden. Uh, right, okay, this treasure chest here. Or treasure chest, this cave. <laughs> Bleh. Hmm. I remember there was spikes blocking my way, but I guess I probably just need to go around the whole area. Maybe I'll just come up from the bottom later on. Maybe it's just a big loop. Oh, this looks like a pretty in-depth cave. Okay, uh, let's just keep going right for now. All right, let's look down first. Oh, okay. Well, I can go right, but... Let's just keep going right first. Ah, grasps. Lovely looking grasps. Wait, can I even go anywhere here? Or is this a dead end? This looks like it's a dead end. Maybe. Can I, I don't think I can sink down there, can I? Can I go down? Oh, yes, I can. Okay. Uh, Alright, good. <laughs> I like when I randomly choose which direction to go to, <laughs> and it turns out to be the right direction. That's always nice. <laughs> but, okay, so I lower those spikes probably, yeah, one screen right. Now I can make my way through there. Yeah, I'm guessing this is just a big circle, this cave, and probably some sort of treasure at the end of it. But, uh, we will see. Uh, oh no. Are these block pushing? Oh, these are pushing puzzles. Okay. Oh, wait. I don't know if I wanted to do that one. Let's reset this puzzle. Let's think about this a little more logically before I start pushing. Okay, I could push... Ugh. I could push this one down. That one left. That one down. Sneak around. Okay, I think I got it. Yeah, this, this doesn't look to be that hard at all. Apparently all those blocks on the right are just decoys. They're just like an alternate... Oh no! No! <laughs> Alright. Mess that up. Let's try this again. Okay, where do I have to end up here? I'll have to... If I push that one... Okay. Let's see if I start here. Push this left, this left, and this up. This left. Uh... Oh, there we go. Okay. I don't know if I did that in the most efficient manner, but I made it. Kind of a difficult puzzle, actually, right there. Okay. Uh, is this one of the... Is this uh, anything? Do I have to kill the enemies in this room to create something? Or is this just... Ow. Ow. Okay, this blade trap needs to go. Let's just ditch this room. See what else we got. It's a pretty long cave, actually, for <laughs> in the middle of a dungeon. Alright, I have two directions to go. <laughs> no! No! No, 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 no! I'm upset. I lost my shield. Oh, come on. Moss, seriously? Seriously, Moss? You're better than that. That sucks. I'm really, I'm really sad. And, ugh. Well, I guess after the dungeon we'll have to go to one of those other dozen caves that have shields. Uh, ugh. That sucks. That really just... Ugh. Ugh. 
I'm so disgusted at myself. But, yeah. Let's see. Alright. Are we gonna get anything in this cave or are we just walking in circles? Yeah, you stupid grasps. Oh, we're back here. Okay. So now we have. All that was for, like, a shortcut. Do these guys even. I don't even know if they actually even grab you. I mean, if they do damage to you, because you can just. Oh, it leads back. Wait, this is not where I came in from, is it? No, it's not. This is a different entrance. Wait, was I, was I over here before? Oh, alright. Random treasure chest. Let's see what's inside. It better be something worthwhile. A small key? It was a small key. So all that was for that optional small key that I probably didn't even need to get. And I lost my shield because of it. And I'm greatly, greatly depressed. Anyway, this was a sad episode. I'm going to go mourn my loss of my magic shield. And uh, I think I'll probably go get a magic shield. I'll probably cut the video and just like start elsewhere in the overworld, get a magic shield, and then resume the video next time. I'm really sad. I, oh. <sighs> anyway, that's going to do it for this video. I will see you guys next time, and we will beat this godforsaken castle. Until then, take care, guys.